Next up, we have Nick Alessandrini with Local Sports. Thanks, Lauren. And we begin today crowning a Delaware native NBA champion. Congratulations to Salesianum and Villanova alum Dante DiVincenzo as his Milwaukee Bucks defeated the Phoenix Suns on Tuesday night, 105-98, to win the NBA Finals in six games. Dante was an instrumental part of the Bucks team this season. He averaged 10 points, six rebounds, and three assists per game before suffering that series tendon injury in that left foot that ended his playoff run. Giannis Antetokounmpo was named Finals MVP in a series where he averaged 35, 13, and five. DiVincenzo now has two titles with Sally's, two titles with Villanova, and an NBA championship with the Bucks in just eight years. Delaware now with a Super Bowl champion in Chris Godwin and an NBA champion in Dante so far in 2021. Smyrna Wrestling three-time state champ Gabe Jim Petro has verbally committed to wrestle at Drexel University. Jim Petro, one of the premier wrestlers here in the first state, has won a pair of state titles at 106 and then a championship at 113 this past year. Jim Petro enters his senior season this winter and will look to make it four straight state titles. He is ranked third in the entire nation at 113 pounds by track wrestling. We're going to stick on the mat here as former St. Mark's and Iowa All-American wrestler and national champion coach Bobby Telford will be holding a free wrestling clinic at St. Mark's High School tonight at 6 p.m. The clinic is free to attend and is for all and any experienced wrestlers grades 6 through 12. Don't miss a great opportunity. You can register now at stmarkshighschool.net. More Spartan news and more accolades flowing in for the St. Mark's girls track and field team. After bringing home a team state championship this spring, some individuals have now been recognized. Head coach Mike DeGenero was named Delaware Outdoor Track and Field Girls Coach of the Year, and assistant coach Rayshawn Davis was unanimously named Delaware's Girls Track and Field Assistant Coach of the Year. Also, state champ Tiffany Herrera was named Delaware Outdoor Track and Field Athlete of the Year. This marks the second time that DeGenero has won Coach of the Year, the first coming back in 2019. Congrats, Spartans. The 2021 Delaware American Legion Baseball State Tournament will take underway this Saturday, July 24th, and run through Thursday, July 29th. You can catch the Post 6 Patriots and the Fox Post 2 on Saturday at 12, followed by the Post 10 Generals and DE Post 1 at 4 p.m. It's a 16 tournament with the winner heading to regionals in Massachusetts, and then championships will be in North Carolina. Now time for some of our throwback top sports plays of our 2020-21 season, courtesy of Delaware Live Sports. This week, we're going to go back to the spring and we're going to get started. It's Peyton Pusey from Red Lion Christian Academy. Here we're going to do it on the softball diamond. A set of triples up first. This is the first one down the left field line, showing off the speed. And then how about another one here up the middle? This one going to get all the way to the fence. Peyton Pusey for Red Lion with two triples and your play at number five. On to number four, sliding catch on his knees and the double play. It's Logan Wiley from Delaware Military Academy here taking on the Spartans of St. Mark's. One of the better games we had in the state of Delaware this year. And check it out, the diving catch out there in right field by Wiley. Then able to double up the runner there at second. Double play for DMA. Now we're heading over to number three here. It's going to be Ryan Farina and Reed Dalton, both for St. Mark's Spartans here. They're going to have some great defensive plays in the field. Two catches right there. You're going to see the diving catch at second first with the play. And then here another one. This one's going to be driven to third and a nice snag there as well. Two plays for the Spartans at number three. On to number two, it's Kagan Brittingham and Laurel. This one again back in the spring. Check out this diving catch from third base. Reads the bunt perfectly, comes charging from third, and then you're going to see her dive. Check it out in slow-mo, able to make the catch. A big-time play there at number two. Then on to number one, St. Mark's DMA game from earlier this spring. Mason DeLuca, well, DMA, they would be your 2021 state champs, and this was a big win for them in the regular season. DeLuca with a walk-off hit to beat St. Mark's in the bottom of the seventh inning earlier in the spring. Again, giving them a lot of momentum into the tournament, and again, they would be your Delaware state champs. Three weeks exactly until we have Eagles preseason football, and just six weeks until high school football.